I thought this was pretty cool. This one is um, a drop down terminal, kind of like um, if you ever play Counter Strike, they have the, the you know the drop down console and you can change your keys or buying your keys. But this one is just a terminal. Uh, you know it replaces that, I guess. You see how it drops down, and after you're done, you're done like that and with the hot key. So it does almost everything like a, a normal terminal does, but uh, the thing that's missing that I hate is that you cannot drag a file in here. I usually like to drag my files, you know, to the path of it uh, without typing it in. But other than that, it does everything the terminal does uh, without the drag and drop uh, feature. That's it. You know, you can do. Um, let me see here. Do the updates, right? Same thing. Right. So let me clear that. And uh, if you want, you can change some preference in here because by default it'll look ugly. So um, after this, I'll use like right click on here and go to preference. And pretty much uh, in here, let me see what you want. Mm, leave almost everything here by default. You can change the fonts if you like right here. But uh, that looks uh, okay right now. And uh, in the appearance here, you, you can you want it to uh, enable transparency, and uh, I'll probably set it to 50, and it looks kind of like this. It looks uh, pretty okay, right? That's the transparency, and you do want the the animation pull down or the drop down menu, uh, like I have it, right? Uh, you can tell it to delay or whatever. Uh, make sure it's from the top because the top is like the sexiest, and uh, whether you want the to expand the terminal even more, uh, it's right here the height and the width, right? So if I wanted to say, like, say, uh, 30, it's gonna expand it. And um, what's this one? Width. Um, let's say 40. Right, and it will expand all that. See that the uh, terminal size has got bigger. And here in the colors. Uh, you can do your custom one, or you can have some defaults one you like. I like a green and black. Um, it looks nice. Uh, that's pretty much it, though. That's all it really does. And um, go ahead and set your hotkey or your, your key binding here. See, I, I, I set it to the grave here, the one next to the the button the number one key. Uh, so that's it. That's all I got for this one. That looks pretty nice when when you use it. See, after you're done. Let it go. Alright. Uh, so that's it. That's all for this for Tilda.